Hey guys, so I'm about to do a foot warm up. So check this out and then you can do it at home on your own. So first thing I want you to do is lift up to your toes five times. If that's too hard, you can go individually. You're trying to land on the ball of the foot. Okay, now what you're going to do is you're going to go up on that ball of the foot and rock side to side. Then the other side. Kind of have to move from your knee, but you try to move from your foot. The next thing you're going to do is you're going to sit down. Get in a position where you can get to your toe. You're going to squeeze each toe. One, two, three, four, five. Then you're going to separate the toes. You separate them the other way. Okay. The next thing I have you do is kind of push between the toes and loosen up that air, the fascia between the toes a little bit and loosen up in between those joint spaces. You can do it on the top too. Then I'm going to have you stick your fingers between your toes. Yep. And then you're going to try to get your knuckles all the way down to your toes. So you're like all the way in. Just kind of stretch it out a little bit and move them around. Don't be too aggressive. But you should have them all the way down to your knuckles. Then we're just going to rub the heel a couple times. Right around the edge of that heel. Right around the edge. Then we're gonna grab right at the bottom of the Achilles, squeeze it a few times. You should see the toes move a little bit. You see how my toes are pulling down when I squeeze that Achilles. And then last but not least, we're no longer gonna use the name. Uh, it used to be referred to as Indian rub. We're not gonna use that. We're now just gonna call it a rub. Go back and forth five or six times. And your foot should be nice and warmed up compared to the other one. You can see how this one has less wrinkles than that one. Then you're going to repeat it with the other foot. Good luck, guys.